Inflation may finally be easing this year, but parents like Jamie McWhorter say back to school can still bust the budget. Everything is outrageous anymore. Yeah. But we'll do what we got to do to save some money. That's why she's looking forward to Ohio's sales tax holiday, which runs this Friday, August 4th through Sunday, August 6th. Kroger's Jen Moore says they're stocking Kroger aisles with items under $3, including pencil cases, as you can see, glues, erasers. So what qualifies for a sales tax break? Clothing items, $75 or less, and school supplies, $20 or less. And remember, all clothing qualifies. It does not have to be a school outfit. Clothing under $75 does qualify for the sales tax free weekend. A lot of people are confused by the $75 rule. It doesn't mean that your whole purchase has to be below $75. It means that each individual item you buy needs to be under that $75 threshold. Unfortunately, $100 gym shoes and laptops don't qualify for the tax break, but that could finally change next year. Ohio lawmakers hope to expand the amount that gets a break in 2024. For now, though, it's still worth it. You'll save roughly $7 to $8 for every $100 you spend this weekend. Because everything always runs out, and I like to get the good stuff. So Grace Duty plans to get out early. Some shoppers have wondered if stores raise prices for the tax holiday, but Ohio's tax department says there's no evidence of that happening. So get ready to shop so you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, WCPO 9 News.